Well, today I'm gonna get to the A-frame level because I'm gonna build it right now. What in the... That's a boat. Uh, boat, got, boat gotta get some more boards from grandma to build it. Huh? And make it float. Love this it. This is made out of wood. Nice. I, I used I choose this one because it's round. Okay. We're a little rushed because are we ever not rushed? Well, we've got a dermatology appointment. See this? You can't see right there. I don't know if you can see that, but it's sore and we think it might be a skin cancer. So we're gonna see about that. Also, New Zealand bus life is coming. Yeah. Gotta build an A-frame. I wanna up the wood, Papa. Hang tight, I'll get you this extra piece too. This will work, I think. Actually, maybe a drill screw for this one. I like this one. You can read it from the top. Come here, I'm gonna need your help. That work nice with the pilot hole? That looks really nice, right? Hey, cool it. Mark post. We've got our lane on one side through there. Now we just measure 12 feet up. It's okay, you got it? Oh wow, that's contour right there. Keep that end on the ground, pivot it. Look at your level until it's level. Milk the cow, edit the video. Hay's coming, no not hay. Well, supposed to come yesterday. I gotta find out what happened to the hay. Feed's coming. We gotta leave at 1.30. Rebecca, you ready to go? Ready to go. You're getting checked out too, huh? Yep. We're both getting checked for uh, skin cancer. What are you getting well, checked for? Do you have a concern? I don't have a concern. Right, right there. there. Yeah. We just go and we get checked out and then we'll go every year from now on and you're gonna be 40 in a couple months, so it's time to act like an adult. <laughs> All right, you ready to go in? So they gave us this cool robe, these cool robes. Rebecca, I'm pretty sure I don't have... No, you don't have Melanoma. Any. No, I don't think you have any. I might have that one. Basal cell. Carcinoma? Yeah. All right, Beck. I don't have any of those things, thank goodness. Only, uh, well, sun damage. Sun damage. So, so you're gonna get, he asked, he's told me I should get a sombrero. You gonna get me a sombrero? <laughs> we ha you do have one. I do? Do you well, know where it is? Let's get home, we might actually be home for the hay delivery. Yes. And we'll get the cattle fence set up. Love hey, it. heck, maybe we'll be done by supper by the time New Zealand gets here. Look back, the hay is here. Hopefully they have it unloaded for us. Look, it arrived just in time, one bale. My day just got crazy. Don't be moving those around. No, They're 60 pounds and they need to dry out. That's 50 bales. What happened to this one? I didn't notice that. Did you just do this? 50 bales. They're gonna bring 50 more tomorrow. We don't, do you see room for 50 more? We gotta get the chicks out in the field. We have to go move the cows. Oh my God. Our lane. Side fences, look, I wanna make those semi-permanent. So there's a side fence here, and then there's a side fence there. And all that we gotta do daily is move a cross fence. According to the season, according to how many cows we have, it's gonna be super streamlined, y'all. Hey, Papa. <laughs> if I ever look for you, I should just look up. Look it in, buddy. Put the automatic shutoff behind the electric fence so they don't tear it up. This is my best attempt at a cross fence area. Let's go. Oh, no, there it is, I can do it. Oh boy. We'll pin it in down here and go up through there, I got it. Let's go get them. Paddock here, access to the woods, a long way over there. It might be a little tricky herding them through here because this is fresh grass here. I just want to get them down there. I want to start down there and then give that a couple days and then let them into this. Just start at our base, start at our lane. Let's get that going. Let's go. Never hard to get them on new grass. Don't even have to call them. Can you go get our mineral shawl or is it too heavy for you? I can get it, it's downhill. Okay. Wow, exactly where I want him to go. Well look, you got it that far, you need help? Yeah. All right, put the wheels on that thing. See this, can you guys see that in this camera? See how there's one strip of lighter green grass and in the middle is dark green grass? That's where the sea monsters were. They're miracle workers for building up soil. Over here is some of the worst soil on our property. It's like 
so thick. Let's get them over here and start building this up with our sea monsters. We gotta get this move the chicks out. Hopefully tonight, while it's warm out here, I don't wanna do it early in the morning where it's dewy. Hey, Jonah, we did it. Unbelievable, unbelievable. Our guests are here from New Zealand, N New Zealand Bus Life. We're going to have to finish. We're gonna clear out for the hay. It's gonna have to be after supper. Hey, after evening chores, with very special guests. You guys introduce yourself. I am Andy. I'm Amber. And we have Daisy and Jake, who's run off onto the farm somewhere. So we've come visiting from New Zealand. New Zealand bus life, right? Bus life NZ. Give me basically. the elevator speech of what of what your YouTube channel is about. Um, so we basically got sick of the rat race, and we bought a bus. Bought the bus. It was a 50 seater school bus. You converted it. This is basically how I see my family at the moment, building the bus. There they are inside. And here I am. Yeah. I did not. <laughs> <laughs> I had no You're idea. You sleep in it though. Yeah yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Good morning. How did you sleep? Very good. <laughs> it was so quiet. Ooh, dreamy. I had no idea how to do it. Um, decided to give it a go. Okay. YouTubed everything and now we have a YouTube channel. We just yeah. cruise around New Zealand and show everyone our country nice. and now we're visiting you guys. This morning we're off to explore maybe Mount Monganui, which is uh, only a couple of kilometers away from here as well, which is supposed to be a really beautiful place. Be fun? Mm -hmm. Chocolate. What is your first impressions of America? The people amazing. are amazing. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, honestly, Good. just so friendly and wonderful. It's been, yeah, quite surprising. Not yeah. surprising, but like we we're telling you, well, we we're telling you before when we, to we told people we we're going to come here, <laughs> yeah. everyone said don't come because it's dangerous and all it's sorts so of things. It's so sad. And it's just been amazing. Yeah. We see the news too. Yeah. But when you travel it, you actually see the people and it actually changes your view from what you see on television. It does. It's so it's nothing like what you see on TV, is it? Nothing no, like what you see on TV. Not at all. The people are so, so, so lovely. Yeah. Good. I, I feel like saying friendly than Kiwis. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Ooh, like, ooh, careful. Do you careful. <laughs> we, won't be allowed, we won't be allowed back. <laughs> what did you say? I feel like they're a, like a little bit friendlier than Kiwis. Oh. <laughs> no, because they like talk to you in the elevator. And you're like, yeah, yeah. You know, they're like, yeah. The now you were from the. So you day. did come. You did just come. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you even gave it a good accent though. <laughs> you came from South Carolina and Georgia. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. Which is yeah. the south, and so like, right. I think that as you get north. Now there's Minnesota there, nice. There is Minnesota nice, but you're not going to Minnesota. But. There are nice people up north, but they won't necessarily talk to you like in the elevator and stuff. Right. right. Yeah. Yeah. But they are nice. We'll say there's a challenge to the northern people. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. They're coming for you. Yeah. Okay. So, and thank you nice. guys so much for having us here. It's oh, you're welcome. Honestly, it's so beautiful here. Slice of paradise. Good. Yeah. Well, good. You're about to uh, work I know, work your now weight. You yeah. Work. You can carry your weight. You ready? <laughs> well, we tried to get it all done before you came. Yeah, we just did. A lot. Live the dream, buddy. Live Grab dream. some shirt. This is actually the fun part. You grab that in. Bring the water. Oh, no, never mind. There's water out there. We got to get this bedding out of here. Ultimately, we're going to put it in the pasture to build up that soil where it's not so good. But for right now, I'm sorry, we're going to have to redneck it up and put it right here. We're going to have to walk over it for a couple of days so we can get it out. We're just going to have to pile it right here. Are you ready? Let's do this. Okay. How long do you think it's going to take us? Uh, I'll do this side. And I can use it. <laughs> yeah. On your mark. <laughs> Good set. Go. All right. What we're going to try to do now is just pick this up. Gird up our loins. All right, Ryan. Are we hitting anything? Yeah, yeah. Okay, we're good. We're good? Yeah, let's go. Okay, ready? Go. We're good? That's good. What? Oh my gosh. You know what? <laughs> Watch out! Oh my gosh. <laughs> Come on, move it, move it. Move it! Whoa! Get out of there, Mindy! Get
You're making me work. Hey, you realize we're like twins. You got an 80 Delta, like me. Same. And then we both have the <laughs> hip shot, the G7X. It's a winning combination. <laughs>